NFL fans notices one major thing missing from games as fed up advertisers strike back. The controversy over racist NFL players protesting the national anthem has only seemed to escalate as football continues progressing into the current season. Blame has now been moved on to coaches and owners for allowing their entitled players to take a knee, which has started costing the franchise money. As another week of Sunday football just passed, NFL fans notice something missing in the stands, and advertisers are striking back with one last proposition before cutting the cord. Now that the NFL is knee-deep in their season, their true colors have shown where the national anthem protests are concerned, and fans are showing just how fed up they are. Unfortunately for the NFL, football fans are not the only ones who are fed up. Many business owners and CEOs have criticized those who kneel for the anthem, yet owners and coaches are still allowing their overpaid athletes to participate in the disgusting trend, but they could be paying for it big time very soon. Over the last several weeks, there has been an obvious increase in the number of empty seats during the football games. As the NFL faces falling TV ratings, pictures are showing that fans are not just staying away from their TVs but the stands as well. This week was no different. In fact, just when the franchise thought fans were over it, they noticed the biggest silent protest yet, which was even more extensive than previous weeks. Fans have spoken out on Twitter regarding the sparse crowds at several games since last Thursday night, and pictures are showing just who is in control of this protest now. About two-thirds of the stands were empty at just about every game that has aired over the last few days, and fans have pictures to prove it. Fed-up fans have created a lot more trouble for the NFL than just the empty seats. The lack of support for the games is costing the NFL more than just the ticket money. Advertisers have reached their breaking point and have given the NFL a powerful ultimatum. According to Breit Bart, as the NFL's ratings and attendance continue to fall, some advertisers are telling the broadcast networks that if they continue to show coverage of players' national anthem protests during NFL games, they will be losing advertisers. Of course, advertisers and fans aren't the only people fed up with the NFL and the disastrous season that has unfolded thanks to the national anthem protests. Others are feeling an economic burden and blame the NFL as well. Over the last several weeks, Several franchises that usually see a boost during football season have blamed the NFL for their poor business, including pizza joints which are blaming a dip in pizza sales on the protests. Hopefully, the NFL will listen. While they could choose to not air the national anthem at all, which is a heartbreaking thought to most patriotic Americans, the other alternative is obvious. Tell the players to stand, and if they refuse, don't give their protest airtime. Focus the cameras on the flag. Make that the star of the show at that moment rather than in titles brats desperately trying to seek attention. These are grown adults, being paid, surely, they really can't be that hard to manage. Although advertisers seem to think that if the networks just stop showing the protests, fans will forget they are still going on, I find that difficult to believe. So, if the NFL hopes to have a healthy business, my suggestion is to listen to their consumers who have made their sentiments perfectly clear. If the league doesn't take a stand, literally, they are going to be too far gone for a comeback. It is more than apparent that the NFL is all but dead, thanks to overpaid athletes who got a free pass to do what they wanted instead of doing their jobs. All people are asking is that there be more of a focus on games and less attention on the protests, which will eventually shut these athletes up. If we want politics, we'll turn on the news or read an article. When we tune in for football, that's what we want. Plain and simple. And simple.